Arabic whiskey is as unique as the man or woman that makes it. What makes it so unique? Is it the water? We hear about the peat yes, or yes. those the two things? No, every, just keep going. It's the water, it's the peat, it's the cask. It's the intent of the distiller and his, and his distilling team. It's the shape of the cap, of the, of the still itself. It's, there, there is a distillery, oh, I wish I could give it to you right now, it's in the space side, where they haven't removed the cobwebs for 100 years. Because 70 years ago, the distiller was about to die and he said, do me a favor, do clean the distillery and passed away. And they've never done it, and they've never shooed the cats out, and that whiskey tastes that way. It contributes to that webby taste. <laughs> something. Well, it has something to do with the air or something. But they all know that if you knock a dent out of a still, it will change that whiskey. If you close the window, it will change the whiskey. If you heat the room, it will change the whiskey. It's a very fine science. It's, it's delicate. Well, it, well, ask anyone who bakes and makes bread. You know, a little time, the water, what a difference. The atmospheric pressure, what a difference. Well, this is whiskey, it's, it's a little more complicated than bread. It's, it's touchy and it has to be done exactly right.